breaking, Hillary Clinton is in big trouble. For years, President Trump has claimed, rightfully, that presidential failure Hillary Clinton illegally spied on him and attempted to interfere with both his campaign and his White House operations. Last year, it was confirmed. It seems that Clinton's campaign paid their law firm just over $1 million so they could turn around and pay an opposition research company called Fusion GPS to create the dossier that started the Russian collusion witch hunt which, of course, plagued Trump's entire four years in office. That's not legal. Now, she's finally going to pay for what she did, literally, and not with prison time. Unfortunately, the Federal Election Commission announced this week that they have fined Hillary Clinton's 2016 campaign and the DNC for lying about funding the dossier against President Trump. The DNC was ordered to pay up to the tune of $105,000. The Clinton campaign will have to pay $8,000. While those fines are far from career-ending, it's good to see one of the most obviously corrupt politicians in America finally forced to own up to her big lie. Hopefully, this is just the first step in what's to come. President Trump is currently suing Hillary Clinton, former FBI Director James Kamai, and a number of individuals responsible for the Russian collusion scandal. Watch Trump's spokesperson explain that suit here. Oh, absolutely. Thanks, Amanda. Thanks, John. It is going to be a great interview. I'm looking forward to that next week. But the big yeah. news today was this uh, bombshell lawsuit. Uh, President Trump is going on offense. He's naming names and he's going after these liars who tried to rig the 2016 election. And when they failed with the fake Russia collusion hoax, when they failed to stop President Trump from winning the presidency, they used it to spy on him, to try to derail uh, his presidency and his administration. Everyone should go and at least read the introduction to this lawsuit because it really is a good recap of up until November 3rd, what was really the biggest political crime in our history. What they tried to do to President Trump and damage his reputation, try to derail his political career, and of course then try to derail his presidency. It didn't work. But there was a lot of cost to it. I and mean, the lawsuit details $24 million in legal fees. They're still harassing him. I mean, we put out a statement today about the ridiculous efforts uh, by the district attorney in New York. But this is really what started it all.